Hi, and welcome back to Talk of the Town. Art Gopalan is back this year to share details about the upcoming third annual Bluffton 8th grade visual art gala held at the Bluffton Library April 2nd through May 5th. Art, welcome back. Oh, thank you very much. So thank exciting. You. This is the third year. Third year, yeah. Much uh, talent uh, among these 8th graders. Absolutely, and that's what we intend to bring out. And the reason why we think it is very important, this kind of show is, the kids in middle school, as well as in high school, um, but although our high school has a lot more opportunities, the middle school kids, they do not have an exposure to the community and showcase what they do other than through perhaps athletics. What we want to do is show them that there are other avenues to excel and for the community to participate and appreciate that. Yeah. And so it, it uh, makes a bond between the school and the community that way. And also it, uh, it allows the, the students to experience excellence in anything, in particular in art. As you know, our, our show is based on a juried art show. It, we take kids, their artwork uh, provided by the teachers, and we submit them to the SOBA, Society of Bluffton Artists, and they provide judges, and they screen, and they select 30 pieces to be mounted professionally by the great frame up at the business and plantation park. Mm -hmm. And we put that up at the library, and the patrons that go to the library can view them, can also vote for their top choice during the month of April. And, uh, and then in May, and this is one of the best features, I think, is that we have an artist reception. We invite the students, the parents, as well as the public. It's open to the public at the library uh, meeting hall. And uh, we then provide or give out uh, awards for the top three people's choice as well as what the Society of Bluffton Artists judges determine top three. And you'll be surprised many times they coincide quite a bit. Yeah. And so, so this gives them an experience of a real art show that they would if they were artists, really. Yeah. And uh, so that's the basic idea behind it. He well, to... it's a wonderful opportunity for these kids, right? Yeah, absolutely. And just like you said, it's so encouraging, yeah. and it builds their self-confidence. Yes. Not, you know, not everybody is athletic. Yes. And so we really have to um, yes. dig deep into the the arts, the music, the dance, the things that uh, you know kids may actually excel at. Exactly. And there are some kids that would try may not make it right but it also allows them to experience that the rejection is not final right you have to explore there are so many opportunities in this world so you cannot you just have to turn your attention to other things that you like right. if you are not so inclined right so it gives them an opportunity it's part of learning it's part of growing and so I think that's what we are trying to do so, uh, describe the process that makes it a premier art event of students in Bluffton and the schools involved. Okay, uh, the teachers, we, we start this process in October, and so we, uh, uh, we prime the pump, so to speak, mm -hmm. and the kids uh, generate the artwork, and uh, in February, we collect the artwork, end of February, we collect all the artwork from all the schools, eighth graders, and then we provide them to SOBA, an independent judging organization, and they judge the quality of work. So that's why it makes it different. We just don't put every piece of work. Sure. And also we are limited in terms of library display space, mm -hmm. uh, which is 30 pieces that we can uh, do. And the other piece of that is the 30 pieces that we, the judges have selected, we give them to the great frame up, who is a prof professional framing people. They mount the work professionally so that it looks professionally uh, done. And then we display them at the library. It runs for a month. 
And so it gives a plenty of opportunity for the patrons to view it, appreciate it, and ultimately say, these are my top choices. And uh, so it, uh, that's the reason why we think it's a premier event. It's an event that's planned and it has got a purpose behind it. And, and then it, it allows uh, enjoyment of the excellence in art in the students. Right. Thank you Thank so you much. much Sandy, Thank you for, for what you do this. for these kids. Thank you. And we'll be right back with Talk of the Town.